or not those wind speed about the same. Quite big waves here, and some quite a big gusts. I've been gusts up to 38 knots overnight. And uh, in the night it was uh, Alex Thompson and Hugo Boss on the route to the Crozet Gate. Images sent yesterday towards the end of the day by the competitor who ventured the most southward. Today, 28th day into the race, and as could be sensed, Armel Lecliage took over the lead of the Vendée Globe. No strategic play for the lone skipper who had chosen a radically different route. I made at the time I had lost by getting to this gate westward, the first. That's it. Now we'll see how the comrades succeed heading south so to pick up more sustained winds. We'll see the gaps then, but for sure it was a positive move. In the next hours, Armel Lecliage could very well increase the gap with his nearest pursuers, who are still at the moment under the anti-cyclone effects. Hello, hello, I'm taking advantage of the light conditions to take you to the boat's bow. I don't think that in the next days it'll be too easy to get here. A nice tip of the hat to Jean Le Cam, who fought like a devil to overtake Dominique Vavre and for showing us the abatros we were all waiting for. This is what an albatros looks like. <laughs>